Danny O'Brien is obsessed with chores. He is absurdly goofy. He's a believer. Authentic, not afraid to make tough decisions. Forgetful, really smart. Detail-oriented, big picture. Silly, awkward, and he loves HMI. My name is uh, Danny O'Brien, or Daniel Baker O'Brien. Oh my gosh, there are so many memories, because during my early years, it's uh, when I was leading all six expeditions every single year, and I was fodding once a week, and I was teaching three sections of history. Expeditions, like first and foremost, it snowed eight inches on my very first HMI expedition in August in the Sawatch, and I thought, what is going on? On the third expedition of semester 15, the story is something along the lines of they had to spend hours, if not days, repairing a tarp that got gored by a bull. There's still a picture hanging on his wall. There was a time that he once went on backpacking expedition with two left boots and showed up to the canyons of Utah with two left boots, obviously, which didn't completely fit him. There was one lunch where there was supposed to be announcements or something, and Danny rallied all the students to go hide in one of the campus uh, cabins. And so we rang the bell and all the faculty are kind of looking around and <laughs> it took us about 20 minutes to figure out that every single student in the semester was crammed into one of these cabins. And my favorite memory was Danny once again being late for faculty meeting and bursting into the room and the clock hung right above the wall. And as he burst in, the clock fell off the wall and hit him in the head. He was out on the road and in between presentations and he called me to check in and one of the first things out of his mouth was, Em, I'm running late, where am I? And I just kind of sat back and laughed and said, Danny, I have no idea where you are. What state are you even in today? <laughs> There's no limit to funny, quirky stories with Danny O'Brien. The best part though about funny, quirky stories with Danny O'Brien is that he's always the first to laugh about them. It's my turn! I love when it's silly. Like, I love when we get to laugh. Um, I love when we get to work really hard and people are asking themselves, what's good for students? When I came here, the board told me my mandate was to improve HMI while never forgetting where we came from. Uh, and I think that's, we've succeeded in doing that. Uh, so when we have alums come back who were part of semester three or semester five, uh, they definitely notice the expanded buildings and they notice how the semester looks different, uh, but the Who's Hall still feels the same to them. Danny's really passionate about keeping alumni connected to the school. He always is going to alumni events. He's reaching out to alumni, calling them, emailing them, catching up with them. And Danny has this really great memory. Somehow he can remember everyone's semester, what high school they went to, when they got married, what their pet's name is. There's a magnetism around his enthusiasm that draws people in. When Danny's around, he's just bubbly and jumping around and reminding you why you got so excited about applying. He has a little bit of kid in him that always comes out when he's around our students, and I think that that makes him a natural leader. Danny is charged by spending time with students. It's definitely the thing that keeps him going. Every moment he spends with students, I know is precious to him because as a former educator, as a former camp counselor, he really enjoys and is fulfilled by spending time with students. Danny will even have sort of almost like cheesy moments of, of like throwing the HMI mission out of like, oh, we're creating great leaders or we're, you know, we're creating thoughtful, you know, thoughtful engaged citizens right now. And we're all kind of like, no, actually we're working really hard and this is not a very glorious task. You know, I think this school needs that champion. He is going for it. And in his tenure, going for it has meant raising unsurpassed amounts of money to support the school and to support financial aid and capital improvements, um, really pursuing uh, the development of a more diverse student body. Danny has absolutely contributed to a huge expansion of campus, the infrastructure on it, and all the ways that we are able to care for and accommodate those who work here. So I think that the on-campus housing 
ongoing is going to prove to be one of the best investments we could have made, both for our campus and also for our people. We've been able to, under his leadership, accomplish so much, including hiring a new DEI director, revising our apprentice model to move from an unpaid role into a paid position. As we have gotten bigger, um, I'm proud of that. I'm proud of the fact that uh, we've added several new buildings that really serve our needs well. Uh, I'm proud of the fact that we're giving over a million dollars a year in financial aid now. Uh, I'm proud of our endowment, which I think will serve HMI well for years to come. Uh, but ultimately what I'm really proud of is that it still feels like the same place that meant so much to our alumni uh, when they were here a long time ago. At the end of the day, it's the people, it's the community, it's the friendships and the stories. And Danny's been, I don't know, such a huge part of that. I mean, that Danny is one of those people who is just emblematic of HMI. Either HMI was built for Danny or Danny was built for HMI. And one thing that Danny always says is, every day at HMI, he likes to think as hard as he can and laugh as hard as he can. Um, and if you're doing those two things every day, no matter where you are, I think you're living a pretty good life. I think the natural world is a pretty amazing teacher. Um, when I think about what I have learned in my life about myself, uh, how to keep going when things get hard, uh, about resilience, uh, about how to lead others, uh, about perspective, uh, each of those things I think the natural world has been my teacher and I'm so glad our students got to experience that too. Just be brilliant. That's what Danny always says to every, all students, like, just be brilliant, <laughs> just, just be brilliant out there. Um, HMI, be brilliant.